I'm Josh Light with Politicket.com. I'm here in Twin Falls, Idaho for the Republican Convention. Um, we're here with Norm Semenko. How are you doing today, sir? I'm doing great. Thank you. And Norm, you are the head of the Republican Party here, the chair? Yeah, I'm the chairman of the Idaho Republican Party. I have been for the last four years. My term's coming to a conclusion tomorrow, and I've really enjoyed it, but uh, we'll be electing a new chairman tomorrow. Are you looking forward to retirement? Yeah, I don't know if it's retirement. It's, you know, it's a volunteer position. I, professionally, I'm an attorney and an association manager, and I've been in this volunteer position for four years, but uh, everything we set out to do, we've done, and the party's in good shape, strong moving forward, and we're looking forward to getting Mitt Romney elected this fall, uh, and I'll, I'll still be involved on the executive committee, but we will have a new chairman. So Let's talk about races going on here in the state of Idaho. Any races that you fear the Republican Party might lose in as far as congressional goes or any other seats? Well, I think we always have to be vigilant and make sure that we're running strong campaigns, but... Our candidates are so solid and they have such wonderful support, financial backing. Uh, I fully expect that both Raul Labrador and Mike Simpson will win handily. Uh, we don't have uh, Senate races this year. Uh, it's the off year of the cycle for us, uh, but we'll be working very hard for Raul and, uh, and Mike. Uh, in Raul's case in particular, uh, we haven't had anybody reelected there uh, in quite a while since Butch Otter. Um, the last two folks, one Republican, one Democrat, didn't get a second term. So. This is Raul's second term he's going for, and we're very confident, but uh, we're, we're not guaranteeing anything. We're gonna work very hard and make sure that, that that happens. And is the party using social media to coordinate activities? You know, the Idaho Republican Party does. Uh, we've gotten very heavily into social media. If you go to our website, you'll see uh, Twitter and everything else that we're, we're doing now. Um, we haven't maybe gotten quite as much into YouTube and some of those things, uh, Flickr, as, as maybe we will in the future. But yes, absolutely, the last couple of cycles uh, we were very concerned about making sure that we were matching and then exceeding what the other party was doing in social media. So we've engaged that very heavily, yes. And do you find delegates participating in social media and communicating with the party through that? You know, not uniformly. Um, the younger you go, the obviously the more you see that with the delegates. Uh, but even Facebook, we're seeing older folks getting on Facebook and doing that kind of thing. So, yeah, it's definitely uh, changed. Um, there's still some people figuring out what email and the Internet are, but we, we, uh, we see more and more people participating in, in the social media, yes. All right. Thanks, Norm. You bet. Thank you.